Okay. It, it's been like a hot minute for me. It's... Oh, I haven't played in like a month. Man, I got real into... Like, I started playing through some of my uh, backlog, and I played through Valkyria Chronicles 4. Good game. Took up a lot of time, though. Hunter. Seem capable of handling this yourself, Well, this I is know. great, because now I don't know how to play, and I'm going to get thrown into a quest where I can't use my weapon. My usual weapon. So this is perfect. I get to relearn everything. But slaying monsters happens Not to even be a particular punished. specialty of mine. Trust me. Won't do you wrong. So... What are we waiting for? Leave this one to me, Hunter. Now, I was told that this quest is kind of hard. So I'm prepared to fail. A commission member should talk to him. Oh, okay. Got some Witcher powers. Okay. So it seems like, uh, Circle is like a mid swing, triangle is a high swing. Is there a way for me to switch my weapon? Like the silver sword. Or is that is that not a function in this game? Good to see you. Be careful. Okay, so I get... Oh, well that's less fun. You know what? This is what I know. So we're going to stick with it. Never seen anything like this before. Wonder what kind of potion you could make with it. Ancient forest, huh? Easy place to get lost, looks like. Should follow the map. Try to find the commission members. I'm gonna get back into the habit of getting stuck. I probably don't even need stuff anymore. Probably have a billion fire herbs. Mission member could know something. That monster mangled pretty bad from what I can see. You got that right. Huh? Geralt, I'm a witcher. See a lot of dead bodies in my line of work. Right, the witcher guy. The commander said you'd be around. If there's anything I can do to help, just say the word. Actually, need to learn about the recent Everyone strange is. happenings in the forest. Everyone's taking in stride the fact that he's not even from this world. Got a feeling that carcass could be linked. You might be right. I've never seen monsters leave their prey looking like this. Like to check the body if you don't mind. Let's have a look. Herbivore, gotta be, judging by the shape of its head. That's right. It's called an Aptonoth. Very docile. They usually travel in herds. All of them this big? Quite the feast for a predator. Yeah, they're actually a favorite among the larger monsters, and, um, well, us too. You could say they are quite tasty. Uh, but yeah. It's not uncommon to see an Abdenoth carcass lying around here and there. Bodies riddled with puncture wounds. Yeah. By something small and pointy. Bird's beaks, 
Lots of them. Looks like a whole flock attacked it. Broken bones, swollen muscles. It was running away from something. Collapsed here. Aptanoth will only run if they feel threatened. The whole herd will run to a safer location. No other Aptanoth around. Whatever attacked this one waited until it had separated from the herd. Clever. So, seems a flock of birds attacked it after it was separated from the herd. Ran for its life while being pecked at. Dropped dead here. It's so strange. I've never seen these birds prey on living monsters. It's just unheard of. Gonna search the area, see if I can find more clues. Okay, I'll be around here if you need anything. Should search around the body. Might find the tracks of whatever did this. Feathers, black. From the birds that attacked the Aptonoth, gotta be. Just need to follow these. Should find where it was first attacked. I should play Witcher 3 sometime. Like, I own the game and Wild Hunt. Or, I own Wild Hunt and all the expansions. I just never got around to playing it. Which is like criminal, I know. Interesting, this ore. Wonder if it'd be of any use in alchemy. There are the birds. Black feathers. And the markings? Same as on the previous corpse. Fox seems to be attacking as one. No use trying to pick them off one by one. Could incinerate them all with Igni, though. Don't see any other way. Well, I missed my chance. I think I dodged that by dumb luck. Seems the black birds are the culprits. Revultures. They're scavenger birds that enjoy large monsters' leftovers. They're usually harmless. I can't believe they would attack a living Aptonoth. Those birds attacked me, too. Any idea why they suddenly turned aggressive? To be honest, I'm just as clueless. Unless there was some kind of external factor? Something significant enough to cause a sudden change in the ecosystem. Something that nudged them to the brink of starvation, for instance? Exactly. It didn't seem like that was the case, though. Did you see how they were flying? Completely in unison. It was like one big flock monster. I've been out here in the forest researching endemic life longer than I'd like to admit, but I'd never seen them do that. It was as if something was manipulating them. Notice anything else in the forest recently? Anything out of the ordinary? Come to think of it, I think I spotted a new form of endemic life. It was just once, at night. It ran away when it saw me, though. Necker could be. Small humanoid creature, ugly smirk on its face. Got lucky. Would have attacked you in the blink of an eye if it thought for a moment it was stronger than you. Now that you mention it, it had something on its face, around its mouth, like it had just eaten something. This forest is teeming with life. There's an intricate food chain here that is constantly revolving. I wonder if that Necker lost its need to attack anything because it was able to find plenty to eat without doing so. Pretty bold hypothesis. Though it would explain why this one wasn't aggressive. They usually are. I haven't seen it in a while, though. I wonder where- Might have sensed my presence. Danger. Run off somewhere. Once I'm gone, it could come crawling back. If it does, I'll send for our best hunter to capture it. Mind my asking why you chose this line of work? I've always loved critters ever since I was little. That... and it's easy-peasy. I'll spare you the details, but long story short, 
One day, I went out looking for frogs, lizards, and snails, and the next thing I knew, I was out here. Just like magic, don't you think? I owe it all to my partners in research for always being so patient with me. See where you're coming from. Got folk like that in my world, in my life, too. They're too good to me. My life wouldn't be what it is today without them. Take care now. Be careful out there, Witcher. Clear as day. This is the work of something that wields magic. Powerful magic. Need to figure out what it is. Should try to find another commission member. Part of me is surprised there wasn't an option to just hit on her randomly. This, I think that's a thing in Witcher games. Exploring unfamiliar territory, few things more interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Inscription of some kind. Can't decipher it. Member of the commission might be able to. Oh, there are, there are side quests here? That's neat. Super neat. I wonder if I can go back to the same one. just heard somebody attacking something? I don't know. There was a definite hop. Got a minute? Of course. No. Take care. Be careful out there, Witcher. No prejudice against Witchers here. Feels strange. There it was again. Commission member should be one in this area. What do we have here? journal notes run margin to margin must belong to one of the commission members need to look around look for clues that's the main quest i kind of want to go do that side quest though looks like it's current location points of interest i can use this to figure out my way around there Get used to that. Never seen mushrooms like this before. It'd probably make an herbalist day to get one of these. Lovely beetle. Kind of thing Zoltan would love to win in a bet. How do I get up there? Is it just as simple as walking up here and around? Yeah, okay. I don't think I've ever been over there normally. That tree looks interactable, but not. 
Is that a hunter I see? No, it is not. You are? Name's Geralt of Rivia. I'm a witcher. Got some questions for you. Ah, the witcher. Yes, of course. I am to provide whatever assistance you may need. Commander's orders. If it's questions you have, fire away. Found some strange markings. Could be linked to the recent events in the forest. Can you decipher them? So, you've seen them too, have you? Those are Gajalaka doodles! Regrettably, I have not made much progress in my doodle research, and thus, I'm incapable of deciphering them. Any chance of speeding up your progress? What would it take? I would need to collect many more doodles, which would require the Commission Hunter's assistance. I see. Well, unfortunate to say the least. Your field of research. Well, I specialize in small creatures called Linians. For instance, felines, grimalkins, and gajalaka are all species of Linians, each with their own unique culture. I spend most of my days traversing the New World, researching their ecology, culture, and lifestyle. Must have strong knees to travel that much at your age. Ha! Perhaps in my more youthful days, but these frail legs of mine just aren't what they used to be. I'm afraid I just can't keep up with the little fellows. By my aching ankles, they are nimble as can be. These days, I just get hunters to track them for me. <laughs> Guess the little creatures here can be just as much of a pain as they are in my world. Take care. What? How is that a failure? Was I supposed to, like, go around the map and collect more doodles before talking to him? Instructions unclear. around Kaer Morn are nothing like this. So you may or may not hear in the background my cat going absolutely crazy. But she's just very happy that I got home from work. Long stride. Deep prints. Took off in a panic. Footprints lead deeper into the woods. Wonder what spooked them. all over the place hmm something pounce on them they get attacked need to look around some more another journal same researchers judging by the handwriting researcher must have been chased into this cave medallions humming up a storm Magic in the air, gotta be. Tree roots, all extending in one direction. Reaching out for something, looks like. Need to follow these roots. More tracks, irregular distance between them. Got away somehow, but must have been exhausted. So far, this is my favorite quest to record, because it means I don't have to talk very much. Because Geralt is doing all the talking for me. Beasts are of this world. Unlucky ones at that. No signs of predation. Roots choke them to death, it seems. Hopefully, whoever left these footprints was luckier. Nope. Oh my. 
survivor? You sensed I was in trouble and came to rescue me. These roots came out of nowhere and trapped me here. Hmm? Wait, you're not from the Fifth, are you? Name's Geralt of Rivia. I'm a witcher. Was sent here to look into certain events happened recently in these woods. Ah, yes. The commander spoke of you. You look quite spunky. Well, welcome to the new world. I would shake your hand, but, well, you know. I am a member of the research commission. A master of the botanical arts, so to speak. Roots seem to like you. A lot. Ugh, I assure you the feeling is not mutual. There I was, minding my business whilst conducting my investigation, when suddenly these roots just leaped out towards me. There was no time to think, so I ran away as fast as my legs could carry me. But these roots are persistent devils. I was able to outmaneuver them for a while, but eventually they cornered me here and, well, I was just in the middle of trying to persuade my captors to release me when you showed up. Mean to say you tried to talk the roots around to your point of view? Bit carefree under the circumstances, wouldn't you say? The Commission has quite a capable hunter, you see. This Sapphire Star is the first to arrive at the scene, and exhibits incredible power that never fails to save the day. Our Sapphire Star has saved so many of us in the Commission. I was sure I would be rescued in no time. But perhaps I rely on our hunter too much. Mm -hmm. Think you might have learned your lesson? Lesson? Why, the lesson has yet to begin! There is much research to be done on this phenomenon. Guess not. Need a hand? Please! There are hunters who are in need of my services. This is no time for me to be tied up in roots. All right. But what's in it for me? Ah, I had a feeling you would say that. Alas, I don't exactly carry a pouch full of zenny on me at all times. However much you require, I'm sure the commander will gladly compensate you. Gotta say, you're awfully lively for someone who's trapped in tree roots. We'll talk compensation later. Don't exactly look like normal tree roots, these. De and, uh, freeing you might cause you some discomfort. Sorry. I leave the method to you. Just get me out of here. This, uh, the fire? Way, but Igni would take care of those roots right quick. That was incredible! Oh my, I had no idea you were a wizard. I'm no wizard. I'm a witcher. Monster slayer. Ah, yes. Forgive me, Master Witcher. Now, what brings you to this part of the forest? I think that this, like, sort of confirms the existence of actual magic in the Monster Hunter world. The Monster Hunter universe, I should say. This is like... When you say you're a wizard, and just nonchalantly like that, the assumption being is that there's actual wizards out there. Let's make that the next weapon type in the next Monster Hunter game. Looking for information. So, like plants so much you became a botanist, huh? It's not that simple, I'm afraid. Sometimes it's hard to tell if I love them or hate them. You see, we Wyvarians have a longer lifespan than humans. And when you live for so long, you become aware of certain things. How fleeting life can be, for instance. But plants are different. I can always count on them to be there, no matter how many years pass. In other words, I chose to lead a life with plants so I wouldn't have to bear the pain of seeing my human companions come and go. Call me Craven, if you will. But that was the path I chose to walk. And if that makes me a coward, so be it. Fear of loss. Wouldn't call it cowardly. It's something we all feel. What's amusing is, thanks to my research on plants, I ended up interacting with humans on a daily basis. Plants have brought back to me what I had once thrown away. 
and I am forever grateful for it. The roots. Why'd they attack you? Any idea? I haven't the faintest. I was recording in my notebook at the time. Notice anything else during the attack? In all honesty, once the roots took hold, I thought I would end up as some monster's dinner. But luckily, that didn't happen. You saw them too, yes? Those poor Puke Puke choked to death by the roots? Seems they were untouched by any predators. Guess the roots attack anything that wanders within range. Damn territorial, this thing we're dealing with. Whatever. Plants can be territorial, but never with such awareness. This is no plants doing. It must be something else. These, uh, Puke Puke, what kind of beasts are we talking about? They are large bird wyverns, known for their vividly colorful feathers and scales. They have large, bulgy eyes and surprisingly long tongues, but if you look closely, their features are actually quite charming. I'm not gonna yuck your yum, dude. Okay. Not gonna kink shame. You should Weird, see one though. for yourself. Mm -hmm. Keep my eyes peeled. Saw roots like these on my way here. They common in your world? Absolutely not. I've never seen them before, and I couldn't believe what I was seeing when I actually did. It is true that plants are able to grow rapidly depending on the stage in their life cycle, but they never grow that fast. In our world, people, monsters, plants, they all operate on the same flow of time and energy. Of course, there are natural phenomena, and at times, things can and do grow at abnormal rates. But those roots are something more. I can't think of any logical way to explain it. The only possibility I can think of is that it might be akin to something like that magic of yours. Time I was on my way. Try to stay out of trouble, would you? Might not be around next time to burn you free. Can't always expect hunters to come to your rescue either. All right, you are. I've acquired the samples I need, so I'll remain here on my best behavior. Best of luck to you out there, Master Witcher. Mm hmm. Just try to keep quiet, all right? Hmm. Controls plants and animals, cunning as a hare and fox combined. No doubt about it. This is a lesson's doing. Bet it also transported both me and that Necker to this world. Seems stronger than a normal lesion, though. Abundant life in this forest could be a factor. All right. Need to find its totem. Should be deep in the woods near the center. Map ought to be helpful. I have no idea what a lesion is. Hopefully we'll fight it. Maybe even fight it. Pretty useful. Medallion's humming. Totem must be somewhere around here. Hmm. Leshen's totem. Should be able to lure the Leshen out by destroying it. Huh? be that easy. Fine. I'll cut you down first. Come on. Come closer. Ever fight a witcher? It's really weird 
seeing Geralt use weapons that aren't just the Come sword. on. Medallion silent now. Seems they were controlled by magic. Leshen could hold sway over other beasts I run into. Need to be careful. Now, show yourself. Alright, what does this thing look like? Fight and We're probably die. Make me should do the trick. I wonder, can I mount this guy? Can I mount that him? All you got? Oh, I can't. It, okay. I forgot that thing had a cooldown, because in the cutscene it looked like he was just gatling gunning digging out. Alright, well, I was literally running Damn. and still got hit. saying what I say. I identify with him so much. Damn. Alright, well let's, let's bleed. This is not gonna go well for me. Okay. How you like that silver? He just did. I missed. Oh, that's so heartbreaking for me. Come on. 
that all you got? Oh, okay. It's fine. That one's not so fine. Come on. Didn't even get my full combo off. Kind of dead. Oh, come on. Alright, so I, I can't to let you get away that easy. I can't make him run into a wall because he just ignores that. that he's just so stationary is throwing me off because like every other monster I have to like dodge and weave around and like this guy just sits there and takes it more monsters what the its power to summon seems centered in certain body parts oh no you don't I didn't I didn't expect to actually how you like what? that hey, silver. Just, you just didn't stop okay can just chill. If you guys can just stop hitting me for like two seconds. I know that's their job in this fight is to distract me and they're doing that. You know the most aggressive that all you got Jagrath I've seen. like knows exactly where I'm going and that's that's throwing me off more than anything
it's waning. It doesn't feel like it. Get rid of this guy right here. How you like that silver? Oh, jeez, I'm going to die. Oh, I'm stunned and bleeding and dead. Use the canteen. Okay, well, I'll dig into my steak. Can I not use? Come on, let me stop with the animation. I just want to go fight him. sharpen come on come closer come on you're doing that twice in a row Okay. I need to sharpen. Damn. And we're stuck. Damn. 
walk into that one. That's fine. Fine! Right. Hey, at least I'm not bleeding anymore. So bad at this fight. How you like that silver? got knocked out. Come on, I was trying to get my shield up. I didn't know it sheathed me. I'm gonna die. Here we go. Where are we going? Over here. No, it's not that's not the button I wanted to press. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Those came out in front of him and I still got hit. Come 
closer. Hopefully that means we're almost done. Oh man, uh, taking a month off from Monster Hunter and then coming back and trying to do a fight that is different than any other fight in the game? Not, not good ideas. Not good ideas. Blade. That's where we're at now. That all you got. Thank you, Jagra. Got some of that. Can, why are you allowed to go through that? Come on. Try and not. Okay. Oh, fuck off. Oh, come on. are so long How you like and I so disagree long. I disagree with these hitboxes I honestly disagree with I'm tired of you even existing. Come on. 
How are you still alive? God damn it. How are you still alive? God damn it! I dare you. The double swing I I knew was gonna happen. I just decided. Okay, now I'm I lost my charge. you not get swung at birds okay i don't have i got the jaguars if i fail this fucking quest i'm gonna be so mad can this animation I don't know. I hate this game so much. I hate this game so much. I hate it because I'm bad. Jaggers are back. Okay. Come on, come closer. You stupid bitch! Come on. I should have sheathed my weapon. Not oh, hurt me. Not sheath. Uh, what is the word? Sharpened. Sharpened my weapon. This is what I should have done, but I did not. I 
did I miss you? Bitch! Oh, okay. Yeah, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine! Okay. hit me. Once again. Alright, I learn. Come we learn. I still get hit. Okay. Good night. I'm gonna die. I don't even have a charge and I'm doing this. I don't know why I'm doing this. Oh, come on. Fine. Fine. I'm not even happy about this kill. Finally. I'm upset. Woods ought to settle down now. Return to normal. Can I carve this? Can I just have things? Can I get something? If there's an armor set for this guy. Leshen drew a lot of nutrients out of these woods. These materials are strong. Should deliver them to the commission. Could be useful in their research. I don't know. I don't know. I just not. I was just not prepared for the amount of just AOE damage that went out. And then just the wide cone of birds. It said something about like hitting them with a slinger to stop its teleport. I think I did that once on accident, but just the speed you have to do it at to cancel his teleport. Absurd. Unless I'm just missing everything about this fight entirely. I'm just not sure. It's just, I, I'm just bad at that fight in particular. You have our deepest thanks. Along with many other fights. Problem on our own. It's been an honor, Geralt of Rivia. Thank you for coming to the new world. How will you get back to your world? Leshen's portals, I think. Pretty sure I'll find one still open. Where's that hunter? While I tended to the Leshen, she cleared the forest of a lot of filth. She's our brightest star, so she's rarely in one place for too long. As soon as that Leshen was taken care of, she was already off on another assignment. She sends her regards. Now then, here's your reward. Hefty as that coin is, it can't possibly have any value in my world. Give it to the hunter. I couldn't have killed the Leshen without her help anyway. And this, also for your hunter. What is it? Leshen runestone. Your hunters don't wield any magic of their own, but in our world, Magic exists in some objects as a matter of course. If a Leshen ever appears again, tell your hunter to use it to summon flames. All right. Godspeed to you. Take care. I did so poorly I still got all this stuff there's now there's gonna be an armor set and probably a weapon I'm gonna actually have to get good at that fight somehow
Oh well, let's go go to the blacksmith and The field teams gathered at the main gate. Seems like they're getting ready to go out on an expedition in the forest. Let's see what the lesson actually turns into. How's your gear holding up? Do I have Leshen Charge Blade? Does not appear so. Thank God. However, also no. What are they used for? Unless I'm just missing it. Oh, there it is. I don't have the money for that. Oh well. I'm gonna go uh, turn in my investigation. No, it's what are they called? Investigations, I think. No? The daily quests. I have something special just for you. <laughs> Nothing will stop us. Oh, bounties. That's what they're called. next time I could do that Fiverr thing. I don't know which quests trigger Iceborne. No, I, I stopped talking, I don't know why. I don't know which quests trigger Iceborne, so I don't know what I should do. I think doing this is safe. But regardless, that'll be it for this time. I did not expect the Leshen fight to take so long. I did not expect to be so bad at it, but I was. Oh well. <sighs> We'll go back to hunting actual monsters next time.